and today we are dealing with Chris Anson. Yes, we all know Chris Anson from, uh, you know, To Catch a Predator and all that. And uh, But today's programme, it's going to be a bit different, so I'm going to go more in depth into his channel. And to be quite frank with you, normally I stay unbiased and, unbiased and I will with this. But let me just say, you know, from the, from in days in the, excuse me, in days in the Chris Hansen days to catch a predator, to up until recently, it's like it's, there's a stark difference between day and night, and uh, <coughs> it's a bit of a sad truth to be honest with you. I, I, I try and like keep it brief, but if you like Chris Hansen. You know, I'm going to be delving into things and properly, and his channel, and also, like, it, what's happened? The kind of a bit since it since it that show went down, and I can I put this? He went from having a big team behind him in his Chris Anson to catch a predator to basically just being him on his own when that show got cancelled because one of the people who who he was. Uh, about to catch, as soon as the police knocked the door, went back to his house and knocked the door, bang, shot himself, guy, you know, he's, he's here no more, the show got cancelled, he got in debt, Chris Anson, and he's been trying to, uh, you know, do what he can to circumvent that, to get over it, to get a new life together, but the thing is, he has, for decades and decades, or however long, he's had a big team behind him, especially spending millions to make him look good, to make him shine, to make everything there. Now it's just poor old Chris Hansen on his own, and he, he's not like a YouTuber, an internet guy, as quite clearly we know now, and it's been looking kind of pathetic and uh, unprofessional, and he's gone off trying to do certain things with certain people and, and it's kind of backfired on, on him and what could have been a good story kind of turned out just pathetic and his channel's pathetic but there's a, there's, there's a bit of a there's a bit of a, a bit of a gold nugget at the end of the rainbow as of recently and let's just see if the trend continues to go the way it was going or it's come out well when we look at the videos I'll explain more let's just get on with it for now Chris Hansen created his account on October the 8th 2019 bear in mind if that show hadn't got cancelled he, he wouldn't have been doing none of this and uh, in that time you know he's, he's uploaded 103 video videos and at this moment in time he's got 342,000 subscribers and he's managed to pull in 20,979,461 views obviously and that's a good amount that is obviously we know he's from uh, US channel type is either all hidden it or he hasn't chosen but he can hide his channel type, that don't matter, I can still do what I'm going to do. If he was going to hide more stuff, I would have found out anyway through, uh, you know, freedom of information, stroke freedom of uh, speech, stroke typing, etc. Everything I do is legit, so, you know, it's one of them, it is what it is. Now, let's just get on with it now. Right, Chris Anthony, uh, at the moment, is it's graded as a B grade. Which is not bad to be honest with you. And out of all the YouTubers in the world, he's in 329,965th place. Obviously, you know, the top ones are going to be like Mr. Beast and PewDiePie. At a subscriber ranking, because he's got like a bit of a large following, he's got he's in 75,418th place, which is not bad. Same as this here, this is pretty good. He's in 234th place, 234,000. 358th place for views. What you gotta remember is there, it's not just dealing with any video what's uploaded, like plenty, I mean, any channel that's uploaded plenty of videos. No, it's anyone who's ever uploaded a video, and back in the day for YouTube, but weren't what it is today, people uploaded one video, got tens of millions of views, they didn't even know, they didn't, they forgot the password, they only used that account once, and they've probably done that six times. 
Out of all the channels in uh, America, it's in 16,014th place, and that's out of all the channels, so that is brilliant. And as we said, he's either read his channel type, uh, or, it's, or he hasn't chosen it, so it's one of them. But <laughs> I'm going to be showing plenty more anyway, but I'm just going to get to the basics, what I normally show first and this is it so don't go anywhere because we've got plenty more to go into trust me anyway at the th in the last 30 days is up is a uh, pulled in 3,000 subscribers and this is what I mean is starting to pull a little back but this is further from the truth as of not long ago but like I said let's I'm just gonna just show this first first page here what I normally show and then we're gonna get into more and in the last 30 days it's pulled in 252,143 views which is not bad it's down 29% 29.5% but it's still brilliant figures now this is a bit pathetic in it for uh, you know what he is because his channel went right down as you'll see soon but his uh, estimated earnings monthly is between $63 and $1,000 it's never going to be at the bottom because that I mean no one's watched any of the videos and it never be at the t I mean any of the adverts or clicked on them and it never be at the, at the top because not everybody has clicked on the adverts and not everybody's clicked on them do you get what I mean it's normally halfway let's just say 500 between 500 and it up to and it could be past the thousand because you have super chat PayPal merchandise sponsorship uh, branding you name it you have all that and affiliate marketing if like on this channel you might see an advert come up at the top here the website I'm using if he does that on his channel anyone who clicks on that and it, on that particular object and it takes them through to Amazon if even if they don't buy that or they do and they buy other stuff he still gets his 10% commission loads of different ways so it could be anything from $500 above let's just say now this is where it starts getting blatantly showing stupid now uh, in February between Feb England between February the 15th and February 21st 2020 a year ago we pulled in 3,000 subscribers then the week after that 3,000 it was kind of like that and then it even went up 12,000 April between April 25th and April the 1st May the 1st 2020 that's when his like his channel he started promising interviews and he was that omniscient he said he was going to do a big interview with him and you know what? it didn't happen all he ended up doing was knocking on his on, on his house it was a big letdown and then when when that onison has agreed to do the interview chris wanted to do it pre-recorded and onison was like well no 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 because then you can edit it so then it went back and forth and it weren't going to happen Chris tried to come out with something pathetic and it just made him look stupid it bigged it all up and it went for nowhere but then Arneson was like I haven't looked too much to Arneson this is just saying what it is I'm just the what it is the guy Arneson was like okay then we can do it pre-recorded but I can I can just video it anyway for my live streams Chris weren't happy with that didn't make him look good and it just went downhill from downhill from there and then his professionalism it was just it, it crumbled it pathetic and it was just one of them then and because his terminology and he ain't got a clue of the internet he started getting used for this that and the other and it, it just went down and this is when things started to go wrong because i mean look he went from between april the 25th to 1st of May 2020, 12,000 subscribers. Then all that started happening. Look at that. The next week, no subscribers. No subscribers. Then 1,000, none. 1,000, none. The week after that. But then check this out. Uh, June the 22nd, between June the 22nd and June the 28th last year. 3,000 subscribers left him, went, his channel started going down, and then it was like that, the next week, he, he lost a thousand them, then none, lost a thousand, lost a thousand, none, lost a thousand, none, lost a thousand, oh, then he, then he kind of gained 1,000, 2,000, the end of October, this is what I mean, the last few months, what happened was, well, I'm going to show his latest videos, as of the last few months so i'm not going to go into the detail on them now but them videos itself has pulled in back 2000 subscribers uh between november the 2nd and november the 8th 1000 then none but then 2000 then 6000 a big jump there 
and either A, it, this if between November the 16th and November November the 22nd, 2020, and t and November the 28th and no and November the 29th, or was it the third and t November the 29th, 2020? 6,000 subscribers on both them dates. So either that's when he pulled back, you can check yourself with the video views them days. If not, obviously he's brought subscribers, but I'm not going to say that. I'm just saying he's, he started doing better up in his production and all that. So it, it kind of half makes sense. So then the week after that, 2,000 subscribers. And it's just been like that. He had one week where he didn't pull in any subscribers. But starting off this year between the 12th and the 18th of january last month 1000 subscribers then none none 1000 subscribers finishing off this week so he's pulling them back slowly but surely same as views views between the 22nd of february and the 28th 2020 so a year ago he pulled in that week three three hundred nineteen thousand and fourteen views and it went up like that it even went up to seven hundred sixty six thousand eight hundred twenty nine views between august the 28th and may the 1st 2020 but then as we're seeing correlating to that on the left where it dips you know it just went his views went down tanking 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 right down right down and it was like that and here, look, minus 20,040, 443 views. So obviously, then he must have deleted a video or YouTube must have took down a video and it's took all the views off him for that. But then it was just pathetic, pathetic, pathetic compared in comparison to what it was like before. But then May, November, sorry, this is what I mean, over the last four or five months, it started changing a bit. He pulled it back a bit and he's pulled in 242,006 views and then it's just leveled off, leveled off. But this year, January 68,000, February, the beginning of this month, today about the 20th, between the 20th and, and the 8th of February, he pulled in 49,000 subscribers and between the 16th and the 22nd, which is today, 22nd of February 2001, he's pulled in 63,798 views now what we're gonna what we're gonna see is now we're gonna have a look at his videos this is stuff that I'm just showing extra and we're gonna see how they performed and how he's clawed it back a bit but I'm gonna be showing more figures anyway and uh, graphs and charts so please stay with me subscribe like see as of recently his last time he, he uh, uploaded a video was the 28th of January so he's coming up to a month now and that was have a seat with Chris Hansen and this is look and, and the 9th of January have a seat with Chris Hansen and it and with them he pulled in 8,400 views and 118,400 views a rating of 34 38.4% so you must have got a lot of down you know a down uh, likes but it's still a lot of views and that day alone that that, for that, that that video he earns between $59 and $474 so let's just say $250 but with everything else PayPal, Patreon, donations, merchandise, affiliate marketing, sponsorship if anybody's going to sponsor him it could be thousands for that video and yeah look th this is where we can say or this new series it kind of upped its production as of a few months ago and this is where the figure is kind of shown but let's just have a look where he kind of if it shows where he lost them it's around here these are all like coronavirus special returning to new york having a replenishing weekend nobody likes all these and it was a bit of let down does it say anything about on his son no but all these are his video views and they weren't doing really well they was doing crap hardly earning him anything at all but recently though there's been a big difference he's upped his production and i just watched one of them and it was like kind of like uh like to catch a predator but instead of like him coming out and speaking to the guy first and then up the police go and gra grab the guy it was the other way around the police grabbed him and then grabbed the guy and then it Dan must have spoke to him he agreed to speak to Chris Hansen and that's what he's done and he's turned it round a bit so uh, these are some of the videos he's doing you know be sure to check them out whether you like 
But we'll get back to uh, normal and I'll show you figures. As you can see, Abby's channel has just dropped. But over the last couple of weeks, we're just before I show you, over the last couple of weeks, we're going to delve into his daily wages through YouTube. And as you said, it's the 22nd, it's the 23rd, sorry, today of uh, February 2001. And on the 10th of February, Wednesday, the 10th of February, Wednesday, the 10th of February, he pulled in 10,663 views. And these are like brilliant compared to when he was losing views. I mean, losing subscribers and he's, 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 you know, tarnished because he didn't have a clue of what he was doing. He was being manipulated. Plus, he, he didn't have that backing behind him and he was doing stupid things. You know, he lost it all. Well, he lost it all when he lost that show, to be honest. But he's kind of creeping back as of recently. But Wednesday the 10th of February, he played, made between 3 and $43. Pathetic, really, as we know. But... This is an improvement. <laughs> it's just whether it keeps going on an upward trend. But just say that day alone, twenty dollars and above. Let's see what the best was for uh, for someone like Chris Hansen, who should be making tens of thousands of days. His best in the last two weeks has been, and this is by Social Blade. So he can't moan at this. Everything I'm showing, you know, this I can do. This I can show. This is between four dollars. And fifty-eight dollars, and that was two days yesterday, yesterday, and and that's what I mean to so say twenty-five dollars. And if he's if he, you know if he's selling merchandise, if anyone's buying it and sponsorship, Patreon, Patreon, Super Chat, all that it could be more. But let's just say twenty-five dollars. So a bit pathetic in it. And uh, let's have a look. What did it say? Your subscriber came is as of now it's what i mean he got all these subscribers as of before for ages ago and then he just lost loads and a lot of people this could be just dead of people that you know who haven't been following him or you know they just subscribe just for the sake of it so it says 342,000 subscribers let's see if it's gone up because this might only update itself every so often let's see if it's gone up in the last four five six days or whatever it could be a couple of weeks if it's going to change it'll be in the next five seconds see this cross here that's like an affiliate marketing link if i go down lower you'll see an advert same as what just come on the screen so he could do this on his on his pages and that's how he makes more money but no his channel's just how it is just ain't going nowhere it's one of them but it's still high because of his name and, and how his channel was at the beginning, but not how it's ended up, even though it's on a bit of an upward trend. But we're going to go into where you can see the stats now. And as you can see here, normally I say if on the left is lower than on the right, then you're doing good. But it's the opposite. Look, on the left, it's higher. <laughs> the way it's finishing on the right. And at the moment, this is like doing well for him and it look for views monthly video views on november 2019 when he first opened his channel he pulled in straight away 2,829,951 views then the next month 2,949,193 views then it kind of even went up to 6,910,428 views. And that was January 2020. But then everything crumbled and it all started going wrong and kind of all big and pathetic. And then it just goes downhill from there. Oh, the next month. Ding, ding. On February 2020, it went down to 2,008,901. That's still brilliant compared to the average kind of person. You know, that's shooting the moon for me, even shooting Mars to get into Mars. But for him, it's a big downgrade, and then it just went down. So, pulled in on March 2020, 93,000, went up to 1.3 million, 914, then it went down. July, June last year, this is when everything was crumbling to 393,220 views then it kind of went up a little tiny bit September went down to 251,000 views then only when's this September 2020 only 82,225 views 
these are pathetic numbers in, compa in comparison to this 6,910,428 views 82,225 views what oh my gosh and then October and I suppose this is where he started his channel started you know you cannot after after using the internet and YouTube I suppose with experience comes a bit of like you know knowledge and with knowledge your skill gets better and his skills got a bit better and he's probably getting a bit a bit of a team behind him nothing like it was even they be out of jobs I hope they're all doing right they're probably watching this is old team you know, I hope, you're already, I hope you're doing well. Maybe leave a comment in the future sometime. Anyway, uh, November 2020, he called in 527,819 views. These are brilliant compared to what there was, but nothing like the 6.9 million, just under 7 million. And December, so, you know, two months ago, 314,000. Finishing off of January, so February is to come. It showed that next month, it's a you know it's a month ahead or a month behind. So in January it was 387,314 views. Wow, pathetic numbers. But if this is getting bigger. I just like a bit of gold, a bit of gold nugget at the end of the rainbow. Just like to say now, I've covered loads of people. I've even done some in the bulk of I know, and he liked my video, and he even left a comment saying he loves my channel and thanks for the info. And I've done plenty of people, so be sure to check out my channel. My channel's just started. I'm doing really well in the last three weeks. Uh, since my channel started, just over three weeks, I'm on 200 and nearly 210 subscribers or 209 subscribers and 650 hours watch time i need to get to 1000 subscribers and 4000 hours watch time so please if you got a heart please like and subscribe thank you but now let's go back to patheticness again <laughs> on a uh, month of january 2019 when you know when he just started his channel he pulled in 88,800 views and that was good subscribers sorry then the month after december 20 2019 sorry 64,000 views and then this correlates with this year i remember when he pulled in 6.9 million views more views obviously you're going to pull in more subscribers but sometimes 10 people could watch a video or 10 subscribe next 100 people only one subscribe so sometimes this subscriber count is not as high as the view because that's because it's just one of them but because the views went up, the subscribers went up and he pulled in 123,000 views, I mean subscribers, January 2020, so a year and a, and a month away. But then watch this when it started getting pathetic. In February 2020, 19,000 views. Then March, even lower, 7,000 views. Then it went up to 13,000 views then it went right down in may when everything was happening when everything was crumbling this channel and you know his unprofessionalism was coming out and because of his age and he didn't have a clue and you know to a degree he has been manipulated but on the flip side of that it's his own stupidity and you know it's, it's only got his own fault to blame me when i, I if i'm going to start a channel before i do something i think about it and i learn about it he didn't he normally has the the, the people behind him thinking for him so I kind of I think that kind of it, it hadn't been in his head that long it was just something it didn't, it didn't cognize in his head there was no cognition there was no ding or perhaps I should like you know learn about something before I do it and anyway with the big letdown and the interviews and all that when it piped up oh and then I think he was saying oh merchandise uh, fleet, uh you can buy this at the other and it never happened this is allegedly and this is why i think i'm on this is allegedly you promised some things people paid certain things but and it never happened allegedly i'm not saying it did but this is what some people have spoke about and i'm just uh commenting on that so let me just fit that in right there you know what i mean soon i have to say anyway on June 2020, he lost 6,000 subscribers. 6,000 subscribers. A few months before, he pulled in 123,000 subscribers. A few months later, he lost 6,000 subscribers. So, you know, he lost them. He lost them, gone. Gone. 
A month after that, he lost 4,000. So what's that? 10,000. After that, 13. I mean, three. So that's what? 13,000 he lost. Another three. So 16,000. And then this is where he's, you know, that little nugget at the end of the rainbow for him and his channel, you know, uh, he started changing things around, a bit more professionalism, and he's got a bit of a people helping him, and he pulled in October 2020, 2,000 subscribers, so this is what I want to say, I'm being unbiased, and I'm being fair, Chris Hansen, if you do watch this, you know, I'm not slagging you off, by any means, I'm not, I'm not you know, I'm just saying what it is, and it, it, it kind of went from good to bad, to goodish now and it's on an upward trend so let's see what happens whether you can like you know uh you're a bit of a wave going you've got to do whatever to keep that wave going you know metaphorically yeah uh, blow the wave do you know what i mean so october 2020 2000 subscribers look at this wow this is brilliant numbers i'd love to pull in this 10,000 subscribers as of november 2020 so that was only three months ago you know, and, and I watched briefly a video of, of some of his recent videos, and, and the good again, it's kind of like the old Chris Hansen is coming back. And then it's kind of like, well, people have just got to try and forget forget about, like, the Chris Hansen in between the old and the new, and what's gone on. Do you know what I mean? It's a bit of the olden days coming back. If I was him, I'd be feeling happy, to be honest with you. 10,000 subscribers in November 2020. 6,000 subscribers, December 2020, this is what I mean, and January, 3,000 subscribers, brilliant, brilliant, I mean, I'm on, what, 209, and I'm buzzing in three and a half weeks, yeah, three and a half weeks, to get that, sometimes it takes people a year, 18 months to get that, this isn't nobody's like me to get that, but, you know, I'm kind of, my niche is, you check out my other videos, and you'll see, I, I break down YouTubers, uh, data, their earnings, I look at data points, which is like, yeah, is, is one point, and there's another one, they're data points, for instance, and I go into all of it from one end to the other, and in between, break it all down, everything, and I'm even going to go on to future projections, I know, but please, like and subscribe, hey, <laughs> so, as I've recently, like we said, his videos, is, it's kind of, it's like they're on an upward trend and they're a lot, ten times better than what there was, you know, when, he's tr when he was losing his, all his, you know, uh, channel, his subscribers, and really his credibility, and his, yeah, his credibility, you know, it's been knocked, it has, his ego must be low, but at the same time, I bet no, he's wiping himself down because he's starting to like a bit of fire in his heart, I bet he's warming up again because numbers are numbers, I'm a numbers guy and I'm showing the data and there's something to be happy about, so you know what I mean, try not to waste him too much, I mean look at all the good he has done, come on, with the catcher predator today, yeah he's been stupid, yeah he has, and perhaps you should have thought before you jumped into certain things like with the internet and YouTube and not having that team behind you. Perhaps you should have thought, well, I best learned some of what they were doing for a living because they were like, you know, making my living and making me look a certain way. You know, we can nitpick all day long. At the end of the day, let's check out them little gold nuggets. Let's give them a break. You know, unless I don't know something right now. I'm normally the data guy, but you know, it's not as if he's a bloody predator, he ain't, as far as I know, he ain't, you know what I mean, so come on, one of them, it is what it is, that's all I'm going to say, nothing more, nothing less, so, and everything I'm saying is allegedly, and I'm just commenting on what other people have said, let me just make that clear, I'm skins, I'm using a laptop, yeah, what was I in, eight years ago, two buttons missing, there'll probably be three tomorrow, you know what I mean, it's just... It's just me in my bedroom, I'm a computer, I'm a laptop, and that's how it is, hopefully things might pick up for me, if, any, if anybody wants to donate to me, first three people, I haven't had anyone do it at the moment, I've got a PayPal down there, have a look in my description, first three people, I'll put the name on screen, and it'll be there forever, hey, <laughs> let's look at his future projections, in the next two months, providing, now these are going to be not too good, and it's going to be slow, but at least it's going in the right direction, it's not going down, and that's the main thing. 
in two months time he should have 347,709 subscribers and 21,781,893 subscribers this is just that the rate is going now but as we can see as of recently he's coming back faster and faster and faster so for instance it's saying it's going to take him 12 months to get to 400,000 subscribers 12 months to get no, this, 12 months to get to 400,000 subscribers if it continues to get as fast as it, as it has done and as quick as it has done as of recently I reckon that you could be doing that in 6 to 8 months if it makes a good good comeback and you know everybody out there they do forgive people only do not forgive certain things and as far as i know he hasn't pushed them he hasn't gone over no line so you know forgiving nature there's people who have not done an whole lot worse he's just been stupid one of them really in 12 months time he's saying he should have 29 million so 50 million market saying it's going to take between two years so about two years three months to hit the 50 million mark so if his channel keeps getting faster and faster what happens is it's called the YouTube snowball effect and the more people that see your video YouTube pays attention and each time then it shows your video the wording and the picture which is the thumbnail to someone that's called an impression and then it and then so the more people that see that impression and actually click on the video the more people YouTube shows that impression to and then that's called the click rate click through rate each time somebody clicks on that impression so if the click through rate's good it's each say if out of 10 people who see his video in his thumbnail the picture say four out of people four out of ten click on that brilliant click rate youtube be showing it to everyone and if something like that happens is the snowball effect it'll be they're showing it to more and more people and with more people watching viewing obviously that snowball it's that imagine snowball going down an hill but instead of picking up snow it's picking up subscribers the more and more people that see picks up more and more subscribers faster 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 so it all depends on that but he's on a very good upward trend that's the main thing if i've got any advice to him it's get back to professionalism you know forget about the last year i haven't looked into you fully and all what's happened i'm just a data guy so please forgive me i'm just going on data alone but i have just done a little bit of research you know and plus like the catch of today, today bloody hell that's the chris hansen hey <laughs> back them do you know what i mean it's all about professionalism if he's got any chance so big ups yeah and let's see what happens anyway that's it for today uh as i said i've done loads of people from gangsters to prison channels to uh comedians i've, I've looked into a lot of people and this is me you know i show what youtubers earn if anybody's got any suggestions please say so in the comments if people agree with that then just put a like next to it and i'll see the interest around it apart from that i do like up and comings so if you know any up and comings people like sammy the ball gravano ah he, he was like he opened his youtube channel a few months ago he's like he was on 180,000 subscribers in the first three months and then i done my first video on him a few weeks later 217,000 I done my other video on him the other week because he went over 200,000 subscribers 200,000 is a YouTube influencer so he hit that status in months Sammy the Bolgavano Salvatore Sammy the Bolgavano he liked my video he commented on it loads of others have so be sure to check out my videos anyway that's it for today you will take care catch you on the rebound bye dum 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 dum